uh, one thing we're really focusing on is being a better situational football team. Um, we weren't nearly as good on third downs as we need to be. Um, I thought that we performed pretty well in the red zone, um, so we want to continue to, to excel in that area and get better. Our expectations is to execute at an extremely high level, um, play with a lot of energy and play physical. You know, if, if we're doing that and our players believe and trust in each other and play for each other, the, the stats and the numbers, usually they take care of themselves. The identity will, will be fairly similar. Um, you know, I, I want us to be a physical run team. Um, you know, I want us to have the ability to wear teams out at the end of games and be explosive passing down the field. Um, and I think that we've showed both those last year and we continue to get better at them. I think there's a lot of explosive players within this personnel. Um, I think having the returning uh, core back in terms of a quarterback, running back, um, some of our skill players and, and a couple of key offensive linemen, um, I think there's a lot of opportunities for explosive plays out of the offense this year. Anytime you have a returning quarterback um, that's had success within your system, um, I think it's a, a big boost of confidence. You know, there's someone in the huddle that, that everyone has confidence in, that they've been in those situations before, they've, they've excelled under fire before. Um, so it, it improves the trust process. Um, and I think it, it allows the offense to play with a lot more confidence in each other. It's similar to what I've met with the quarterback. I think that boosts the confidence level in the group a ton. You know, they know that, that he can be the spark within the offense, um, that on any given play, he can make a, a, a really tremendous and a big play for the team. Um, so I think that the offensive line has a lot of fun blocking for a player like that. You know, I, I think everybody's involved in our success. I think everything always starts with what we do up front, though. Um, so I think our offensive line is extremely important and how they develop and the leadership within that group, you know, losing a couple senior leaders is big. And, you know, a couple of guys have stepped up in camp and have started to take reins of, of that group. And that, that's big for us because, um, you know, we can only go as far as, as the big guys are going to take us in the end.